Oh, wow. He's beautiful, right? Okay, don't touch your shirt or your shirt. Shorts, go wash your hands. It's recording. A good size fish, bro. I just gotta watch out for them. Rod and reel? No, uh, throw line. See, this is this is difficult to work because it's such a long blade, but I can make it work. I just gotta find the hook now. Yay. Yeah, sorry about that fish. Hi, Adam. Hey, Mom. How are you? Doing good. I didn't know you were here. See how easy it is to break once you go all the way through that? Yeah. See, he's dead now. Whoa, yellow. Right, Dad? Yes. 13 pounds. That's a beautiful fish. That's good eating size. My favorite kind of catfish. Give me my sharpener with the blue handle and a, the small knife like this. Should we cut this fish? You want to record this? Yeah, I'm recording. That's just a finger hole, see? See where I put my finger? Mm -hmm. That's where I used to hold it, man. But I gotta get rid. I gotta get rid of the butt, which is what I just did over there. And if you hit that seam just right, it mm -hmm. splits it. See? Okay, those are off. Just see. see when I cut the butt out. Now it just lets that whole three part come out. See. Is that what it looks like inside of a fish? That's what it looks like inside of a fish. Yeah, I, I've seen a bigger fish. Hey, come on now. And, yeah. yeah. And have a bigger I've seen shark. bigger kids too. Get back. Watch out. Get back. Oh, I see. I see it so. <clears throat> Mm -hmm. um, hey, hey, what did you say? I'm glad him. Okay. What, well, baby? Why do fishes not have a brain? They do. Yeah. It's just small. Smaller than um, a, a rat brain? Hold on, baby. Let me record this. Let me point again. Okay, then this, this is the next step. This is where it takes a razor blade or a very sharp little blade. I have a razor blade I use. Yeah. This one has got some mosquitoes out here. Like the little one behind the... You gotta get it all the way off. Now, if I don't see little jack on your head, hmm? there's a little jack on your back. Okay, you know what that thing is? That little green thing? Hey, Elijah. Hmm? Go inside and tell Grandma to give you a tray, the one we use for the chicken. The Just tray for the chicken. The tray for the chicken. Tray for the chicken. Hurry. Tray for the chicken. Tray for the chicken. Tray for the chicken. Hurry, go get it. Ask Honey. Say, I need the tray for the chicken.
careful here is not you see how you're holding on. I got three hours of sleep last night. <laughs> so yeah, I mean, hot. The tray. A tray that they normally use for chicken. The tray that I used for the chicken yesterday. Oh yeah, I was gonna tell you guys, it's like it's unbearable, man. It was 90 degrees at nine o'clock last night. Yeah, I was I slept in underwear and I was drip dripping all night long, non-stop. I bet. But now what do you do? Well, if they'll bring me that tray, then I like to just take these off. And this has to be, have to be real careful because there's pulling all in here, see? And it's just really tough to get out of the way. Those bones are strong. <laughs> they swim against current all day long. See, this is all. This is all good meat on their bellies. Yellow cats, you see that? Yeah. Channel cats is nasty. Yellow cats, that's a steak. That's a. Thank you. That's a premium steak right there. Honey, just washed it. Thank you, honey. I'm wash it, so. Thank you. Hey, let's do no peas right there. So I take those off to begin with. Cause these ain't no good. See, there's just bone in here. So see, that's a steak. That's a. One time I helped a buddy oops, clean one of these, and he said, "Take what you want." Okay. So in this, you see that line right there? Mm-hmm. Right here? Mm-hmm. So you can see it right. I see it perfectly from here. Yeah. So you just follow that. That's that's the steak right there. You just... mm -hmm. Same thing here. So you can see the folds right there, right? Yeah. And I already removed that. So just, just follow that. Keep the steaks. The head. I don't ever keep the head anymore. I don't. There's a steak in there. I mean, a big bone in there, too. So sometimes, here's a... Oh, you see, Grandpa, you really need a pair of dice. Oh, yeah. That to break any bone. Or bone. anything that'll break bone. I just use those, because that's what I've always had. And this, watch this. A lot of people struggle with this, or don't know what to do with it. This meat ain't no good. You see how it just follows? Yeah. You see, that ain't no good. So I would just start to take it out. And this... See, can you see in there? Yeah, that dude just all come out, yeah. and you want to get it out because it's in the future, it's just in your way. So, I just tend to you can rip them out. But bigger fish like this, hold on, bigger fish like this, you just cut, cut around a little bit. As soon as Alvin saw it, he goes, That belly, though. <laughs> that belly steak or that belly meat. Yeah, that's what he said, huh? Yeah, uh, he goes, that's see. where it's at, boy, right uh, there. Uh, see, he knew that's a steak. See, if you pull that out, and it's out of your way from now on. And this one, it's actually got a lot of meat on it. And then this one, you just pick a spot and cut it. This is another kind of tricky one to cut out. A lot of people will use those. Dikes. The dikes. That's what Grandpa does. But I don't, I just cut yourself. So we're gonna go ahead and finish this dude up. See, it's not, see how they, they get real bruised back here, especially when they're nesting, because they make their nest with uh, their tail. Okay. 
it. So I just cut it out. And if you want to cut it into rest, this is where I cut it. See where the joins right there? Mm -hmm. the difference. I just pick a spot in there somewhere. Cut across. Break and make sure you cut all the way through. Board. Oh. In case you didn't know it. <laughs> the two by four in the yard. Yeah. I just went I just went right on the spine. And you can you can try to fillet that off of there the the, the, the silver skin mm -hmm. I do sometimes see there's fat right there you see all that mm -hmm. I don't ever keep that see and you can it depends on your knife but this one's doing pretty good see you, you, that's that red that's stuff that's what you're taking off see the knife did a pretty good job. See, but you never want to eat that. And if you leave that skin on there, that's what you're eating. That you can live with, but... Even that'll give that oh, slight yeah. discoloration. Aaliyah ate a piece of drumstick last night. Chickens have similar stuff. And she goes, this isn't cooked right. And it wasn't the chicken, it was just that piece. See? So you can trim that up a little bit more when you get to cook. With scissors and all that, right? Yeah, see, I take that off. But... This is the thinner end of the fish. That's the good stuff. And this is the good stuff. And it's crazy because on channels and blues, oh, man, I... those uh, fillets are uh, pretty thick. On the back end? Yeah. Yeah. Well, see, like nice. this, I keep all this, even though this bone, but I trim all this edge off because that, that's usually where the fat is. That's the spine? Yeah. That's all the bones in there. See, that's all that's left after the fillet. But I eat that. I cook it and I eat it. That's what I eat. <laughs> I like that. See in there again. Watch this. See, all this meat up here is good. Right? I'm using my fingernails. Right there. It? Yeah, I've seen that technique. On. Gloria? She's in there? I didn't know she was in there. What's she doing? Helping Serenity cook on the phone. <laughs> See, I just make my fish look good when you fillet them. So you can try to cut this off. Be careful and don't waste meat. It's better with a small knife and go slower. This one, watch this. This is where. Oh, okay. Right? This is the tail end. And that's where he was sitting, you know, like this. Yeah. Right? So here, look, I start right there because I'm feeling for the spine. See the spine right, is right here, right? I mean, yeah. the whole, the whole rack, right? So it's the continuation of this. Yeah, right? yeah. I'm good. I got a good picture here. So I just kind of follow all the way down along there and yes. cut down. But on this end, see the ribs? Mm hmm. I'm just, I just try to follow him straight down. Okay. And this is where a good flexible fillet knife, what, can you see the blade flexing? Oh, I see it, yeah. Come on this side, you might see it, but you see how it flexes. See, I'm just going right down. Oh, yeah. Right down the ribs. The ribs are up here. Only right here. They stop right there, right? But see. Yeah, that's all I'm doing is following the ribs. And then once right here, I kind of get past them. 
See, and there's a big other big piece of meat. Oh, that's what I was talking about. See? Yeah. So that's one. We'll clean that up in a second, and then I'm gonna do the same with this one. Find the bone. Go all the way to the bottom. See, and then I start working. And then up here somewhere, you know, the ribs are right here. And there again, see, I just avoided that bone. And all I do is I'm just feeling it, see. And if you get your, if you got the right knife, watch. I'm used to my knife. You see it flexing? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. You see? That's the way I do my knife, see. Oh, you, like, shave it off. Yeah. But the knife has to be giving. Then yeah, you're like shaving it off. See? Oh yeah, that was good. Yeah. See, but that's. <laughs> I cook this on my fish. I cut all this off. See all that red? Mm -hmm. I cook all that, but I don't think you're gonna. You don't eat that unless you want. I'm gonna to. offer the fish to you, Dad. Oh no, you take this home and just. No, I'm gonna go get more. <laughs> You're a busy guy. You don't have uh, all the time in the world to be <sighs> See? wrestling one out of the Guadalupe anymore. See, yeah. See, there's no bones in here. None. But the video is more valuable than the fish right now, I promise. See, this is the stuff I take off. And when people say, dang, you cook good You don't want to keep this if you're keeping the fish? No. Mm, yeah, I'll keep it over here. Yeah. I'll clean that up because I eat that. But you see, even even the trim, even when I when I clean them, I take I take as much of the fat off. And anyway, but that's why people say, "Dang, this is good." But, uh, squared. <laughs> but anyway, watch this. See, it's got the same stuff, right? The same skin. Uh huh. This is tough to. This, I don't want to waste any, so let me, I'm going to get in your way. Ta-da. Uh -huh. That's how you fillet a fish. And if you really want... Line. Yeah, you see all that stuff? See? See, when I trim a fish, I'll even cut this apart. See? But that's why people say, man, this is good. Ain't no different than everybody else except I take all this little stuff off. You'll never bite that. See? You'll never bite this stuff. And it's a yellow cat. And it's a yellow cat. Yeah. Let me try it again on this one. See? I got squared up. up like that we'll try it again let's see if i can do it again it takes a sharp knife so this is working good but i can tell i'm losing a little bit of edge let's try this again Ta -da. That's a flathead. That's a flathead. From flathead to flathead. <laughs> <laughs> I got your head. <laughs> okay. All right, stop and video. Cut.